morning, Zanetta. I got your message. See you later today. But Z, and see, I had to start off the morning with a little piece of cake. Remind myself about the crumb. Good morning, B. Good morning, Ruth. Bunny love. I had to do a go little cake, Z. All right, good morning. Hope you are up. Where I'm at, it is raining and it is wonderful. I love it. This is the kind of this is the kind of stuff that gets me pumped up on a Monday. That the rain is falling. I'm thinking about new life happening because in every raindrop, there is there is life that is beginning to be activated underneath the soil in the dark places. So I'm excited because I think of rain is just a picture of life, and I think of what we see naturally. And think about what's happening internally. And so today, as I look at the rain, I'm thinking about what's happening inside. Good morning, Jennifer. Good morning, Leah. And so the, the rain is falling on the outside. And then, you know, people got their windshield wipers going. They got umbrellas out and raincoats and galoshes and all that great stuff. And But on the inside, I'm thinking, what is being activated? What's being activated in each one of us? You know, and so the, with, the, with the soil being becoming wet, seeds starting to get water and, and, and what it takes to soften the shell. Um, New Life Fitness, good morning. Uh, what's what's beginning to happen? You know, what's, what's taking place? What's taking place inside that seed that's now getting that little drop of water that it needed so that that shell will become just a little bit softer so that as it's pushing, it can break free. You know, what, what, what in our life is going on that is softening our situation so that we can break free? See, sometimes, you know, we have this, this shell around us that's enclosing our, our possibilities and, and enclosing our potential. But we don't oftentimes realize that, you know, the elements of life that are coming, the water, the rain, the, the, the situations of life that are coming are sometimes softening our situation. And they're working in our favor. Sometimes we get so busy complaining about the rain. We get so busy complaining about storms that we don't realize the storms are, are, are starting to weaken the shell that's been closing us in. And so our possibilities and our potentials are, as they've been pushing and being strong and pushing out, there's, an, there's a situation on the outside that's, that's beginning to get weaker. And so when, we, when our situation begins to get weaker, while we're getting stronger, we're getting in position to overcome and to dominate our situation. We're getting ready to be broken, broken free of what's been enclosing us. But there's a choice that we have to make. We have to decide that this day, I'm going to push, I'm going to do something different. I'm going to go beyond where I've ever gone before in order to have something new. And so we get, we have to get our mindset around being willing to do something new, being willing to push out of the comfortable place, challenging ourselves to go beyond where we are into a new environment. Doesn't make it, doesn't mean the new environment's going to be easy. The new environment is going to be scary. The new environment is going to be encapsulating as well. But the new environment is going to open you up to a new push. And because you've just broken the shell that's been closing you in for so much time, you've been, you've been trapped inside the shell of who you are for all this time. But right now, once you break through that shell, you get to be in a new environment. And so our, our mindset should be today that I'm, break, I'm breaking out of where I am. I'm so tired of being comfortable in this place. I'm so tired of living in this shell. You know, some of us, we just hold inside of us all of our unique, you know, oddness, our inner oddball, as I say. You're holding your inner oddball in. You don't want anybody to see it. But today, today's your day. Today's your day to, to push a little bit more because the rain has come to soften your shell. And now, with your push, you can get a little crack in the shell. There's, there's going to be a crack in the armor. And so you can begin to go forward. And what that looks like, it looks like you putting yourself out there. You letting the world know that you have a song. You letting the world know that you're a trainer. You letting the world know that, you know, you're good with children. Whatever it may be. Whatever your inner eyeball is, today is the day that you push just a little bit more to break the shell that's been holding you in. And if you do it, your life will, it will have opportunity to sprout in a new place. Good morning, Tamika. Your life will have opportunity to sprout and grow in a new place. But it's all up to you today. It's all up to you to do something different. It's all up to you to push a little bit more. You know, I'm thinking about training and how 
during the cycle of training, we will go from uh, one type of discipline to another type of discipline to begin to produce so that the body and the mind will experience something new so that the body's muscles and the body's ligaments and joints, the body in itself in its totality will be challenged a different kind of way. It will have to learn something new. And so when you do something different, you put yourself in the position to learn something new. You put yourself in the position for your, for your innate, inherent greatness to become even more intelligent, even more expressive of how great it is. You have to start to see yourself as, how, as, as a wonder, as a wonder worthy of all. That when you become who you are, when you release the inner oddball, when you nurture that and grow that and let it out and you show the world exactly who you are, then your life will begin to take new form and new shape. You know, so often we, we, we leave ourselves in that seed state and we're just content. We're content being seeds. But you're, you're meant for more than that. In your, in your seed is so much greatness that as you plant it, as you water it, as you grow it, as you grow into it, others will be fed, but you will be seen in a way of showing your full greatness, showing your full potential. And so today, that's what we're going to do. We're going we're gonna to take the challenge to branch out and to stretch out beyond right now beyond where we are and step into a new place and say, you know what? This, this shell, this shell served me. It served me long enough though, because the shell was, it was good. It protected you for a little bit. It kept you safe. It kept people out. You know, perhaps you had been in some, some tough situations. You were hurt. And so you had your shell and you put your shell on and, and you were inside of it and it was okay. And it was good. It was good for a moment. And there was a time in, in, a, in, a, in a season for you to be in your shell. There was a time for that. Because the shell kept your purpose safe. It kept it enclosed. It kept it away from certain predators. But now, the season of being in the shell is coming to an end. And now you must push out. Push out beyond the shell so that you can experience the soil. There's another challenge waiting for you. you you've been in the comfortable zone long enough and now it's time to push beyond the shell break the shell and move into the soil because in the soil there's some nutrients there's some some uh minerals some things that you need in the soil that are going to feed the sprout it's going to feed the seedling it's going to feed everything all the purpose that's been inside the shell that's now breaking feet free there's some stuff in the soil that's going to feed you and help you to grow you'll be able to draw from another environment. See, the shell is keeping you blocked. But once you break free and you're just packed in by the soil, the soil is going to enrich you. And so you can begin to look as you break free. You can begin to look for resources. You can begin to look for people that will uh, help you, people that will talk to you, people that will share insights with you, people that will, you know, opportunities for education where you grow and develop and learn and, and you can start looking for money. You can start looking for that stuff because now you've pushed out beyond the shell. You've let the world know I have something to give. And because you have something to give, the world is saying, oh, well now I have something to give too. And see how this is how it works. Once you give what's inside of you, once you give it, then others will say, now I have something to give too. You're giving to others, they'll be giving into you. And so today's the day that you take this challenge. Because I challenge you with this. Break free out of your shell. Let someone know that you have a gift. Share it with someone. Tell them. Say, I really, you know, I'm really good at baking cookies. You know, I'm really good at doing hair. I'm really good at, I'm really passionate about, you know, selling jewelry. I'm really, I'm really passionate about, uh, instructing others. I have this passion for special education. I have this passion for supporting others. I, whatever your passion is, you begin to talk about it. I love butterflies. You know, but whatever it is, you know, I can knit. Whatever your thing is, today's the day for you to start to push out. Let it out a little bit. Let, let some water, let, let this water that's been soaking the seed and weakening it, let it now, just break free a little bit. My challenge to you is to break free a little bit. Share with someone what's in you. Push out. Push out a little bit into the soil so that the soil can begin to enrich you. 
Because there are things that's in the soil that will help you. Begin to push out today. This is my challenge to you that you push out. Like, I'm out of the shell. I'm out of the shell. I'm sharing my gift with others. I'm going to let someone know what's in me. And if you do that today, your life will begin to change. Thanks so much for joining. Today is a day for you to go and do what we always do. Dominate your life. Dominate it. Take your gift. Grow your gift. Nurture your gift. Expose your gift to the world. Share your gift. Serve your gift to someone that needs you. New Life Fitness. Share your gift with someone that needs you. You are a lifesaver in your environment, in your gift. Your gift will make a difference. It will make a difference and it will open up opportunities for you. As, you. as you cultivate your gift and grow your gift and share your gift, your life will change. I love you all. Dominate life.